Welcome to Moomoo Math and Science and Rules for Significant Figures. Significant figures can be frustrating in science and chemistry, but if you look at the rules, it can be fairly straightforward. Let's first go over the rules and then look at a couple examples. First, count all non-zeros. Two, count zeros that occur between non-zeros. Three, and this trips up a lot of people, leading zeros are not significant. For example, point zero zero four, you would only count the four as a significant figure. Trailing zeros, if there is a decimal, count them. If there is not a decimal, do not count the trailing zeros. Okay, so now let's look at a couple examples and apply the rules. Up first is 3.8. This one is fairly straightforward. You have two uh, non-zeros, so it would be two significant figures. 10.3. Okay, what do we do with the zero? Remember, if it's between non-zeros, the one and the three, then you count it. It is three. This next one, point zero six three zero, you have two rules that apply. First, you would not count the leading zero and you do count the trailing zero so you have three. The reason why you count the trailing zero is that you have a decimal. Okay, this next one, 2012,000. Okay, well remember you do not count the trailing zeros if you don't have a decimal so it is three. Okay, this next one, 2.040, it has a decimal so you count the trailing zeros, so that is four. And finally, this last one, 9.0. Don't get tripped up by this one. It would be easy to just say one, but you have a decimal and a trailing zero, so you would count it. So that would be two. So there we go, rules for significant figures. Thanks for watching, and Moomoo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.